Hi guys, welcome to this quick comparison between the Seagate portable hard disk drive for terabytes and the western digital same thing same size also transportable external hard disk drive and they cost pretty much exactly same price so how are they performing against each other regarding speed regarding noise vibration and heat I've tested this for about two hours now and this is the result. We can see the Seagate has been performing a little bit faster here on the larger files with one exception but most of it uh, was faster with the one megabyte blocks and with the smaller blocks it was a little bit slower. We can see that here, here in this area here we have almost everywhere higher values than with the Western Digital and here vice versa here a little bit lower results lower speed uh, regarding the smaller files and here a little bit higher speed regarding the smaller files for the western digital and to explain this a little bit this is just normal everyday usage this is not peak performance of course we can achieve much higher values when we go into sequential reading and writing easily above 100 megabytes or even more that's no problem you don't have to be worried about that these products uh, are very slow or something like that and they wouldn't achieve the values which they are uh, stating in the listing no it's absolutely not these are just normal everyday values and we also get confirmation here with the second tool seagate here dotted lines you can see uh, on the larger files it's a little bit faster on the smaller files it's a little bit slower and western digital exactly opposite so they are uh, on a very very similar speed level but how have they been holding up regarding vibration noise and heat and maybe also one thing regarding the size and the equipment i mean this or the bare models absolutely no extra protection outside or so and we can see that seagate is a little bit larger here uh, regarding thickness they are pretty much the same this is more a little bit round this is absolutely flat but it has a little bit uh, a larger length but same width it's just a little bit more length here with the seagate and what we also see with the western digital we have this four soft rubber feet a little bit of anti-skid effect which i definitely like on the other hand i have noticed that the seagate was uh, much more quiet absolutely no vibration even if you hold your hand and ear and everything uh, absolutely close to the hard disk while doing this test there's almost nothing to hear and feel this is absolutely insane how quiet and how low the vibration are with the seagate with the western digital uh, we have a little bit more i mean both are on a very good level but here you can feel it a little bit hear it a little bit i mean i'm not complaining about it both on a, are on a very quiet level but the seagate is even much more quiet and has less vibration regarding the heat i would say maybe the uh, western digital uh, kept it a little bit more cold i mean i'm not saying the, the seagate was heating up i was just feeling a little bit of warmth but absolutely nothing to worry about so we have uh, basically a tie here i can't give you a, a real recommendation or like a warning to stay away from one of these products absolutely not i would say it's more like personal preference and maybe uh, something to consider if you are using more larger files or smaller files but that's already it and if you want to have it super quiet then maybe it's the seagate but uh, i think both are really good products and i can highly recommend them and i'll put down the link to both of them down into the description so you can check it out and order it right from there if you like it and i hope i've been able to help you a little bit with this video if you have any questions or comments just write to the comment section below and i'm always happy to talk about these things and if you like the video give me a thumbs up subscribe my channel thanks for watching see you next time